Hello everybody, my name is Holy and welcome back to another boring episode of Forgotten Games Analysis, the series where we look at games that were forgotten about either by developers or gamers in general. On today's episode, we are looking at the 2010 poker game, Poker 9 at the Inventory. Well, it's like I said in the intro, a poker game. The catch is it's made by Telltale and has beloved characters from four different series. It's, 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 the Heavy from Team Fortress 2, Strong Bad from Homestar Runner, Max from Sam and Max, and Tycho from Penny Arcade. Whatever that is. You just play poker with them and sometimes use bounties to buy in, and that's how, if you beat them, that is, you get some cool TF2 items. Well, time. It did well and got favorable, favorable reviews from critics. But I guess that many players who played TF2 at the time would only play the games for the items, the games only for the items, and never play again, which is a shame. Regardless, the passage of time got to the game. The sequel, Poker Night 2, didn't exactly help with keep the game alive either. Unfortunately, in 2018, Telltale Games underwent a majority studio closure, and it gets messy, but Poker Night of the Inventory was taken off of Steam. It's a poker game, and I'm a 15 year old kid who can't play poker at all. It's good, and the dialogue between characters is alright. That's about it, really. Items you can get in TF2 are cool, too. I have no honest idea on how to obtain the game, though, so good luck with that. Stay tuned. Like the video? Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have any ideas for future FGS or videos? Join the Discord below. Have a good one.